Hello, my name is Jen Matthews, and I'm excited to be here today talking to you about the importance of reading to your children at any age. I am a mom. I have two little ones. Ada, my daughter, is six, and my son Lincoln is almost four. And then I also have a stepson who is about to turn 16. I have been a classroom teacher in early years education for 11 years, and then I've been an Usborne consultant for three years. So, encouraging children to read has been a part of my life for quite some time. And so I just want to talk about how reading can benefit your child right from the very beginning. So uh, as early on as 18 weeks into your pregnancy, your baby can recognize your voice and can hear it. So starting right then by reading is going to benefit them later on in life and if you have little ones at home then you can be reading books to them as well and your fetus will hear it uh, doing some rhyming books like dr seuss and nursery rhymes are great books to read however also if you don't have children at home or if you're just spending some time relaxing yourself and reading an adult book that's okay too. read it out loud because your fetus is going to hear your voice and start recognizing it creating that bond with you and it's gonna help you relax which in turn is going to help your baby develop into a wonderful healthy baby now, once your baby comes along, you can continue to read to them nursery rhymes, like I said, and those rhyming books. Um, I have some here to show. So I mentioned Dr. Seuss, and then just some classics like The Gingerbread Man or Old MacDonald, The Three Little Pigs. And nursery rhymes are fantastic because of their rhyming words. Plus, you can also do some of them in a sing-song voice, which is great for little ones. Um, as they get a little bit older and they start being curious about books themselves and wanting to touch them, having books that have touchy-feely parts in them, so things that are fuzzy and rough, all kinds of things that they can touch. And you can get them encouraging them to turn the page when they're ready. Um, lots of baby books have nice thick pages that they can grab and turn themselves. There's also fun interactive books out there as well. And here's just a little example. There's not a lot of story in this one, but for older ones, they, these have moving parts. And these kind of books just get your little ones excited about books and wanting to look at them. And then as they get older, they're going to have a love of books already and this will encourage their love of reading and what's so great about encouraging reading is then it also uh, uh, sorry, encourages their curiosity. Your child is going to be asking questions, they're going to want to read books to find out more. And the last thing, you are also teaching them a nice calming, relaxing tool that they can use. So if they're having a bad day or a bad morning, they can take some quiet time, curl up with a book and enjoy it. And if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to me and I would be more than happy to answer them for you. Happy reading.